In this training, I'm going to show you how to use regular expressions in the Mozenda Agent Builder. As you see here, I'm collecting a list of restaurants. What I want to collect is the addresses associated with each restaurant, because I want to know how many restaurants are present in each postal code. Normally, if I want to capture an address, I'll simply hover my cursor over that address and click. The builder will recognize the various fields within the address and split it up for me, and I'll just click Save. However, this feature is only designed for U.S. addresses, so you'll notice here that the postcode is not being collected correctly, even though it's present in the address. So we're going to need to delete this capture action here on page 1 and manually split the address up into separate fields. You'll need to do this every time you're capturing a non-U.S. format address. I'll start, once again, by clicking on the address. Instead of Save, I'll choose Capture the Text into a new field. I'll name this Postcode, because that's really the only field I'm interested in for now. Rather than Save, I'm going to choose Save and Refine to open the Refine Captured Text window. This is the same as clicking Save and then choosing Refine Captured Text from the Selected Action menu. The first thing I want to do is become familiar with the data I'm capturing. I'm really interested in the postcode, and I note that it's made of two sets of three characters separated by a space. So we'll start with this. In my capture definition, I'll check the box next to regular expressions. Now, you may see a number of characters here you're not familiar with, so I'm going to remove all of the non-essential characters, and we'll start from scratch. What you're looking at now is what a field name looks like in regular expressions. To type the regular expression command, I'm going to move my cursor before the close parentheses. You can ignore these other characters and pay attention solely to what I'm typing. First, let's start out with that pattern that we noticed. Two sets of three characters separated by a space. The command in regular expressions for any character is a period, and we're looking for two sets of three. So, I'll type three periods followed by a space followed by three periods. You'll notice now that the characters being collected are two sets of three characters separated by a space, but it is the end of one word and the beginning of the next. So we're going to need to become more specific in our regular expressions. Let's look at the target data again. The postcode is made of more than just two sets of three characters. The first set is made of a letter, a number, and a letter. Conversely, the second set is made of a number, a letter, and a number. So let's specify that pattern in our regular expression. I'll delete what we've typed so far, and we'll start from scratch again. Let's do the first set. A letter, a number, and a letter. The regular expression command for a letter is backslash w. Now, if we want a letter, a number, and a letter, we're going to have to do a number next. The command for a number is backslash d. I'll follow this with one more backslash w, and we'll now have a letter, a number, and a letter. Following this, I'll put a space, and now the next set. I can see that this set is made of a number, a letter, and a number. So I'll type backslash d in my capture definition, followed by backslash w, followed by backslash d. What we now have is a regular expression that looks for a letter, a number, and a letter, followed by a space, which is indicated by the dot in the capture definition, followed by a number, a letter, and a number. As you can see, the target text is being highlighted in the content window, and it's showing here in the capture text preview correctly. If I click on Next Item, I can test this expression that I've written on all of the items in the list. I can see that it's capturing the postcode correctly wherever it's present, so I'm going to save this definition as is. This concludes the Mozenda training on the basic use of regular expressions within the Mozenda Agent Builder.